When you're getting dressed and you have no idea what to wear, one of the most powerful tools you can utilize is a classic color combo. Today, I want to break down some of the most timeless, sophisticated, expensive looking color combinations that will land you a good outfit every single time, I promise you. We're gonna go through five core colors of black, blue, brown, olive, and cream. I'm so excited. I'm gonna bring in some classic examples of some of my old outfits in addition to some new pieces that are so on trend for fall right now from today's sponsor, Revolve. If you guys missed my first part of this collab with them, I did a traditional versus modern work outfits lookbook. Be sure to catch that for my workwear girlies out there. But Revolve is one of my favorite shopping destinations for literally any type of occasion, from casual everyday basics to elevated workwear to ball gowns for formal events, like they have everything. And I've got some incredible pieces that I'm gonna be infusing in some of our examples today. As always, everything mentioned in today's video will be down below. I'll be utilizing the YouTube shopping feature. I will be tagging the Revolve products. They'll come up as a pretty carousel. It's an amazing way for you to browse while you're hanging out with me. So I love you guys so much and let's get started. Let's start off with the ultimate power color, black. So the first pairing with black that I think is the most classic of classics is gonna be black with white. Now, obviously black and white, when it comes to a work context, such a go-to, especially if you're wearing a black suit. But you notice if you just stick with black and white, it could look very blocky and kind of plain. So one of my favorite ways to style black and white that feels more modern and fresh and multi-dimensional is to incorporate different patterns and trimmings together in one piece. For example, this one is a cream base with a black intricate weaving on the bottom or this Majorelle set from Revolve. This this one features black and white trimming on both the cardigan tank and my newest addition that I'm obsessed with. This is a knit skirt and cardigan mix, but you have all of this unique stitching, contrast trim, and it gives it so much more detail while still remaining to the classic black and white. Second favorite way to do black and white is to incorporate opulent details, which means to layer on gold hardware in terms of the jewelry, or with the buttons and hardware detailing. I am literally obsessed with these Revolve vests because they look so chic. And one of my favorite easiest style hacks I'm gonna drop on y'all real quick is that if you have these crew neck button up vests or even sweaters, you can wear it very demure and classy and modest by having it fully buttoned up to showcase all the buttons and having coverage or you can unbutton the top two to three buttons down to the v-neck of your liking and then take the tails and fold it under underneath your bra straps and you have a completely different look the subtle glitz of the gold hardware brings a lot more life and leans into that expensive aesthetic to spruce up your black and white combos final option i love for black and white pairings is to do a pattern oh my god i love this dress this one also i just got from revolve the reason why i love this as an example is that it has a classic black with white polka dots, but there's also a floral like embossing onto the fabrics. You get this variation in sheen. Second option for black outfits is black plus camel. I love the fact that black is just a stark, powerful color and it gets warmed up with that camel, which in and of itself is an elegant color. And this is a great combo also for the office, especially if you're bringing in a rich camel coat with an all black number under underneath. It's very slimming. It's very sophisticated. It's a knockout outfit no matter what. So in contrast to that, the last option for your black outfits is black and gray. The grays, the heather grays still give great contrast to the black, but this is the option for people who have a predominantly silver tone, cooler tone accessories. I think it has a very muted feel and is still also really classic. Color category number two is going to be blue. And my specific favorite for this time of season is navy blue. Literally one of my favorite all time patterns is the navy and white pinstripe. You saw this one from the All The Ways brand in my workwear video, but I got this brand new baby. It's just so oversized and cool. It feels very 80s. And one of my favorite ways to style this navy pinstripe pattern is with crisp white. So navy and white look great together by itself, but I love the pinstripe because you automatically can pull the light from the pinstripe to really emphasize the white bottoms that you're pairing it with. And I think that one of the best accessories 
accessory combos to pair with navy and white is to go with a camel or brown accessories. That gives a nice rich warmthness to it, a very preppy, nautical look. And then the final color combo with navy that I think looks great is also gray, especially during the colder months when we have a lot of heathered gray options. I think that paired with the navy gives that nice cool tone contrasting color combo that's less harsh than when pairing it with black. Both of them are amazing, but if you're not into like super dark black colors, I think that the navy and the gray is a great option. And again, that combo looks also amazing with silver tone accessories. And then the final thing I'll say before we leave this category, if you're watching this video during the spring to summer, there is nothing like a crisp bright blue paired with white and then adding on the saddle brown or cognac accessories. That is like the ultimate color combo, especially if your blue shirt has white stripes in it. Number three, color combos for brown. I think that brown is also just like a super trending color that you've seen the past few seasons. I think a great color combo for a straight up brown like this is brown with beige. I think beige gives it just enough contrast, but it's still warm and not so stark of a contrast compared to our darker colors. I like to think of a latte, right? We've got like the nice brown from the coffee, but then when you pour in the milk, you have different variation shades of cream swirling throughout. And then you put this cinnamon on top and it spikes it with darker shades of brown so you can do your darker cognac accessories to mix with the brown and the light beige. If the brown and the beige is feeling a little too latte for you, another way to bring in a more stark contrast is to go with a darker chocolate color. This one is a very elegant, stretchy, comfortable knit shirt also from Revolve. This espresso can really pop. On the other side of brown classic color pairings, you could also do brown and black, which I know I know that could be a little controversial, but we are mixing so many neutrals these days. Absolutely brown and black can work together. I mean, for example, even when you're looking at designer bags, I love these classic prints with the Fendi and the Celine, where you're mixing super dark, rich, near black colors with brown. This kind of ties in the colors together, so it just makes sense. Or you can feature a piece of clothing that has the two colors together, like this sweater from Revolve. I love the soft feminine shape of this sweater. You have the classic houndstooth pattern. So all you have to do is pair this with another pair of black trousers or brown bottoms to pull out either or of the accent colors in here. And you have brown and black mixed together in a very harmonious way. And last but not least, I cannot exit the brown section without talking about the classic trench coat. You can put it on anything and you look so effortlessly chic. And I bought this one from Revolve. This one is from a brand called Heart Loom. This is a classic trenchy trench coat. The collar is made out of a contrasting darker herringbone. So right here, I can wear this trench over other shades of dark brown underneath. Color number four, another personal favorite. We got to talk about olives. Olive is a really powerful neutral because it's something different than your typical brown, black and white. It adds such an earthy richness to all of your outfits. But in a way, it's like a cool accent color because it kind of mixes with like all the other colors and neutrals that we're talking about today. So I think that a classic trench also looks amazing in olive, but because this has like very military roots, the utilitarian like army green color, I think looks so awesome together. My first favorite pairing with olive is white. One thing I really like about it is that it brings a freshness to it. Here we're getting that really nice contrast. It really makes the olive pop. It's also a really great color combo for our in-between seasons, like summer to fall. Second olive pairing, is olive and black. This one is more subtle because the olive is darker, but I think that this is a very powerful, masculine, again, utilitarian look, and I think it's also really great for the office. Next, obviously, olive would look amazing with shades of brown. We are in like the earthy, natural tone playground here. So new brand that I'm trying from Revolve called Stitches and Stripes. This is the cutest little sweater dress. This looks amazing with all of my cognac accessories. Screams fall season. 
you have a nice textured knit with the leather, so you're getting contrast there. And final number five, there is something so light and airy and feminine about going all white or all creams. Talk about a classic color combination in terms of like all the ways you can go monochromatic. There's something so beautiful and feminine. This combination does really, really well when you pair different materials. So you can do like a shiny, satiny type of top, but with some linen pants that have like a flaxen, organic look to it. And I think this combo looks amazing with the cognac and brown accessories that you have. I think that it creates just an overall really warm, inviting look. Then I would go all in with like the gold accessories to bring even more added warmth to the soft, creamy colors. All right, you guys, so that does it for today's ultimate color combos. It doesn't even matter where your clothes are from, whether it's high luxury or affordable, basic, whatever. If you start off with just thinking about some of these key color combos, your outfit is gonna get to a good place. Again, everything featured in today's video will be down below in the description box. If you guys made it here, you already know, leave your girl a white heart emoji down below in the comments to know that you made it to the end of this video. I love you guys, my OG fam. And if you're new here, be sure to give me a like and a subscribe. I will love for you to join the family. Thank you guys so much for your time. Thank you to Revolve for sponsoring today's video and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.